This is a Nagami kumquat that I bought in the spring of 2018 from a local nursery. It's been a pretty good tree. Um, it nearly died about six months after I got it, and it's just because I didn't know what I was doing at the time. I potted it in a bigger pot with some potty mix from the big box store that said citrus and cactus potty mix. And after nearly dying, it uh, lost all its leaves. It, the branches died back to about almost the graft. And by this point, I was realizing that I had a lot to learn about growing citrus. So I did study and um, I found out about um, potting citrus and coconut husk and some other uh, medium that is fast draining and lets the roots get plenty of air, but yet stay moist. And so it's been doing pretty well and it's kind of slowly recovered. Uh, last year it started producing. Um, I probably got about 12 fruit or so but this year it's really outdone itself. It's got close to 100 fruit on it. One thing that I try to do is um, right before I'm about to harvest the fruit, it should be ready in about a month or so, is I go around and check for bugs. Um, we have mealybugs in our area and one thing about mealybugs is that they, um, they like to find plants that have fruit that is um, ripening um, because they know that the um, the plant is pushing a lot of sap towards those fruit and if they latch right next to the fruit or actually on the base of the fruit or in the general area of the fruit they're going to get a lot of sap pumped into them from the tree so I just want to zoom in here and show you some mealybugs there's one right there. I'm trying to get the camera to focus. There's uh, some more. The little white fuzzy thing is actually a mealybug inside. They're actually kind of a brown color, but they get that white coating on them. And that's just because um, they suck so much sap that they ooze it out and it molds. So that's mold. So what I do is, um, is I take my little paintbrush here and I get some just regular rubbing alcohol. And all I have to do is just dip it in there and just brush the mealybugs. It's basically instant death, game over for them. And I found it to be more effective than trying to use oil sprays and that sort of thing. Oil sprays take a day or two for the bugs to actually die. And then you don't really know if they're dead or not um, unless you actually remove them but with the alcohol I'm actually kill them and remove them at the same time and just have to take my time and just go around um, when your trees are in a pot and they're this size then it's fine but if you had a big tree in the yard it wouldn't be very practical so that's what oil spray is definitely good for one last look thanks for watching today